I'm in a unique role as a chief financial officer of a large church and seeing money all the time. But I, I, I went into that role because I had a heart for people. But when I got into ministry intelligence, I saw that this product was something that could serve churches. And as my role as the CFO of a church, a growing church, you know, that's a mega size, some would call, uh, people can come in and out. And so how do you track those people coming in and out? And finance is a great way to do it. And ministry intelligence will do that for you. So ministry intelligence tracks through the donor profile. We create donor profiles within the platform of Sage Intact. And then those donor profiles have a first time gift, a second time gift and, and on. And then when they become a regular giver, the ministry intelligence will identify them even if they haven't set up recurring giving, which is a very powerful feature to be able to understand, hey, this giver is regular, they're, they're recurring, they're sustainable. And so that is something that we can track with ministry intelligence. And then if they happen to lapse or stop giving for whatever reason, ministry intelligence will identify that quickly so that our pastors can reach out and, and talk to them. And our pastors, when they reach out through, because of the, the information given to us by ministry intelligence, they're basically gonna connect uh, and say, hey, you know, we've been praying for you, been thinking about you, is there anything specific going on that we can pray for? We never will ask them, hey, we noticed you stopped giving. That's something we never do. I mean, this is a tool to help you minister. It's not a tool to help you get more money. That's not what it's about. So uh, we're excited about that. We're gonna use ministry intelligence on first and second givers to maybe just write a note card, just, you know, just a handwritten note card saying thank you for your gift mail that out, nothing really intrusive, um, but something that would just be a contact point. So that's how we're gonna use it. So the, the, the six different dashboards that are available within Ministry Intelligence give you the opportunity to filter down and present data to your executive board, the, the financial board. Our executive board is, really plays a role of leading the finances of the church. So we use this and I, I demoed it with them and just they were very intrigued about what it could do you know, early on and so now they're really hungry to see those dashboards in our board meetings, which is gonna be a really powerful thing to be able to show the data, sustaining giving, and then make projections on this data, cash flow projections, sustainability, and understand, okay, this is what we can forecast and project on projects that we're looking to build. What I would advise people to look at Ministry Intelligence is it's one place that you can go and get executive or even corporate type finance data as well as ministry type metrics, you know, giving units and you know, average giving per giver and things like that. So I would suggest that people really need to dive into Ministry Intelligence as a one-stop shop some place that they can just go and get all of this information without having to go to different platforms. And that's gonna be a game changer and a time changer. Really, you know, ministry intelligence isn't just about money. Ministry intelligence is about, I like to use the analogy of Proverbs 27, 23, where, you know, know the condition of your flock and then have the heart to tend after them. So ministry intelligence is gonna help your pastors, it's gonna help us as churches to be able to identify those people who, are, who maybe need a touch uh, uh, from God in their giving, it's being, being able to identify the health of your people in your church and then being able to reach out to them when you notice something in the finances that maybe is just a little off. You may not know what it is until you reach out to them, but that's the powerful thing about this tool is that it gives you the ability to identify those who you need to reach out to. So that's what I love about it.